Adventurous kids explore with education and learning what a wildlife is in the Everglades. I want to explore the museum of discovering science. What plants do butterflies like? I want to know about Key West. Adventurous kids learning and fun. Adventurous kids! Today I'm going to tell you about photosynthesis. Plants make their own food in a process called photosynthesis. Photosynthesis is the process plants use to change light energy into chemical energy. Plants collect energy from sunlight and use this energy to make a sugar called glucose. This chemical energy is stored in the form of glucose. Glucose is the main source of nutrition for plants, fueling their cells for function and growth. Photosynthesis occurs mainly in the leaves of plants. Very little, if any, occurs in the other parts of the plant. The chemical that gives plants the green color, chlorophyll, is the same substance that converts light energy into chemical energy. Chlorophyll is found in chloroplasts, tiny objects found in leaf cells. A cell is one of the tiny building blocks that makes a living organism. Photosynthesis takes place in the chloroplasts. Chlorophyll also traps the energy from the sun so the plant can use it. As well as the light energy from the sun, other substances are required in photosynthesis. The first of these is carbon dioxide. Carbon dioxide is a gas that is present in the air. Plants collect carbon dioxide through tiny holes called stomates. During the process of photosynthesis, stomates are also used to expel a gas called oxygen. Stomates are tiny holes in leaves and stems. Oxygen is very important for animals like humans. We need it to breathe. The one other main requirement for photosynthesis is water. Water is absorbed into the plant through its roots. Plants take water from the soil through their veins, which is called xylem. Xylem is wood in trees. Plants also need minerals from the soil to grow. Nitrogen helps them grow and make leaves. The first phase of the process must have sunlight, but the second phase can happen without sunlight and even at night. The second phase is called the Calvin Cycle because it was discovered and described by scientist Melvin Calvin. The Calvin Cycle is a process that plants and algae use to turn carbon dioxide from the air into sugar, the food autotrophs need to grow. Photosynthesis is very important for life on Earth. Green plants build themselves using photosynthesis. Algae, protists, and some bacteria also use it. The first organisms on Earth to use photosynthesis appeared roughly 3.4 billion years ago. An organism that uses the photosynthesis process is called a photoautotroph. Thanks for watching this episode of Adventurous Kids. What did you learn today? Adventurous Kids. Adventurous Kids. What was the most interesting fact? Adventurous Kids. Adventurous Kids. Adventurous Kids.